Welcome back. A new program could help more people in the area become educators. It's called the West Michigan Teacher Collaborative, covering learning expenses, providing mentorship, and more. Fox 17's Marisa Overly explains how this would, in turn, benefit students. Marisa. Yeah. Jamie and Josh, it's really a unique program. Those behind the initiative say many people want to teach, but some barriers, like the cost of college, hold them back. They hope this program addresses any concerns so kids get the education they deserve. Michigan needs teachers. We've had shortages of positions in our schools, um, including at the ISD, uh, and have been harder to find teachers to fill positions. Brandy Lindquist, who oversees the Muskegon Area Intermediate School District, understands that all too well. A 2022 survey from the state's largest teachers union found 20% of them expected to leave the field for a different career within the next few years. The Michigan Department of Education says the number of people enrolled in college to become a teacher dropped significantly too over a 10 year period. However, he thinks the West Michigan Teacher Collaborative can reverse those trends. I think the program does more than just get teachers in the pipeline. I think it provides support that uh, may or may not have been there in the past. It's a new initiative between the ISDs in Muskegon, Kent and Ottawa counties that looks to turn employees like paraprofessionals into teachers. The West Michigan Teacher Collaborative would pay for them to get their degrees through Grand Valley State University, then help in their transition to the classroom. Many could also get stipends up to $20,000. In addition to those financial supports, you get all sorts of wraparound services. So you're a member of a cohort, um, you have additional professional development. We support you as you look for a job as a lead teacher. Laura Castle runs the program and adds those with a bachelor's who want to switch careers or current teachers that hope to get an advanced degree may participate too. She believes the West Michigan Teacher Collaborative can help more than 300 people over the next three years. A $19 million state grant provides its funding. We're especially excited about the impact it could have on critical shortage areas like special education or English language learning um, or students growing up in poverty. Um, we think this initiative is going to make it possible where there are teachers who not under not only understand the unique needs that those students have, but are skilled enough to meet those needs. Morgan Daly, who works alongside Castle, echoes that sentiment. She hopes the initiative not only recruits and trains the area's next generation of teachers, but retains them too. Think about the kids. Think about your children. Think about the uh, teachers that you've interacted with um, before in the past, or think about your um, teacher that you really looked up to as a kid and while you were in school. That's the impact that you can have being in this program. Now, people must apply for the West Michigan Teacher Collaborative. Applications are open now through November 1st and just and in just the first five days of those applications being open, 68 people have applied. If you'd like more information on the program, you can head on over to our website for a link to theirs. Reporting in the studio tonight, Marie Soberly, Fox 17 News.